In a while, Dodoria. I've been waiting to get you alone. Not so tough when Frieza's not around, huh? You impudent Saiyan! You sure have got a lot of nerve! and get lost. If you go quietly, I'll let you escape this time. I see. That explains the abrupt break in your transmissions. You've lost your scouters. You want this, don't you? Are you going to hand it over? Did the fear finally sink in? <laughs> Vegeta, what are you doing? Why did you break it? Because I don't need it anymore. Don't pretend. You know I'm vastly more powerful than I used to be, and you're very afraid. You underestimate me, Vegeta. This is God's this if you can! Come on! Die! 
Calm now, Dodoria. Did you really expect that move to work? Huh? I nearly died back on Earth. But since I'm a Saiyan, I'm now far more powerful than I was before! <laughs> Let me tell you a little secret about the planet Vegeta. The planet Vegeta wasn't destroyed by an asteroid. Lord Frieza destroyed the planet himself, along with every Saiyan on it. <laughs> Sorry if this comes as a shock to you. Don't get me wrong, Dodoria. I couldn't care less about my planet, my parents, or my fellow Saiyans. What I do care about is that things applied to me and used me. That angers me more than anything. Gah! So, Frieza fears the Saiyan race, does he? <laughs> I've defeated Dodoria! Still, he said something strange. I see. The brats I was chasing were Earthlings. I can feel two large powers getting farther away. Those can't be the Earthlings, can they? I wonder. Perhaps I should check it out. In any case, I must eliminate anyone who stands in my way, even if they're not worth fighting. Oh.